In this video, I'll show you how to set up VAT rates in your store. Make sure the module is enabled. Before setting tax rates, you should set up destination zones, locations you are going to sell your products to. It's important in order to have taxes calculated correctly for different zones. In order to set destination zones, go to Store Setup, Countries, States and Zones. Tab Zones. Create zone. Type in the name. Save changes. Click Edit. Specify the location. If you are going to sell your products to different countries, you'll need to create a separate zone for every country. So I create another zone for Ireland. Besides destination zones, you'll probably need to set tax classes, in case products in your store have different tax rules. For example, VAT for books is reduced and even has a zero rate in some countries. We go to Store Setup – Taxes. Tap Tax Classes. Click on the New Class button, type in the name, and Save Changes. That's it! When adding or editing a product, you assign a tax class to it, on the basis of which the tax will be applied to the product. If no tax class is selected, a default tax class will be assigned to the product. Now let's check how to set VAT in your store. We go to Store Setup – Taxes. You can rename the tax here if necessary. Make sure it's enabled. The price specified for a product in catalog is supposed to already include VAT. So we can define if prices in our storefront should be displayed including VAT as well or excluding it. Select the checkbox if you want product prices in the storefront to be displayed including the VAT tax. With the checkbox unselected, prices will be displayed with new tax included. Define on which pages in your storefront you would like prices to be labeled as including or excluding VAT tax. I'll select on all catalog pages, and there will be a corresponding label on all catalog pages, informing customers if the price includes the VAT or not. If you want tax to be calculated depending on membership levels as well, keep this checkbox unselected. Define if tax rates should be calculated on the basis of billing or shipping address. The price defined for the product already includes tax. Now you need to define which membership and which destination zone the tax is for. If, for example, VAT in your catalog is defined for United Kingdom, select this area. For customers from other locations, the tax will be excluded from the price you defined for the product, and then a tax rate defined for the customer's location will be added. For example, my product price is £34.99 sterling. I have United Kingdom selected here. VAT for United Kingdom is 20% and for Ireland it's 23. If I log in as a UK-based customer, I see the prices defined in the catalog. If I log in as an Irish customer, I see a different price. UK tax was extracted from the amount and Irish tax was added. If prices in your catalog are defined excluding tax, then in this section you'll need to specify a membership and an area having a zero tax rate. Then VAT will be added to price defined in your catalog for all zones. Not registered customers will see prices without tax and will get the info on the tax as soon as they specify the address on checkout. In order to add VAT rates, click New Rate. A new line is added. Select a class, a membership level, a zone, and a rate. And let's add another rate for Irish customers. Click Save Changes. Now let's see how it works for customers. When a customer goes to the cart page, 
The price for the product is specified with the VAT tax excluded, and there is an amount of VAT tax displayed as well. If we go to checkout, the amount of VAT tax is also specified. Thank you for watching the video.